Well, hello and welcome to Darkness Falls mod. So, uh, yeah, this is a brand new mod pack, and the first thing you're gonna want to do when you get in is uh, hold up, don't give me tasks yet. I haven't even started. All right, let's throw on the backpack. First things first. Get this down here. Put that up there. And we get two blank class paper books. Basically, you get to choose what class you want to do, and each class has its own area. I personally am going to go with mechanic and security. Well, you know, mainly because this is going to be armor and guns. I like armor and guns. And this is going to be vehicles. I like to use vehicles a lot. So that should help me with the vehicles. Locate a trade up 100 meters away. Hold up. No way, guys. Hold up, hold up. We have just got probably the best spawn you can ever get in this game. And I'm going to show you guys something really cool about this mod pack right from the get go. As you can see, these guys up here. Come on. Hey, you come, come this way. Come on. Come on. Do it. Do it. What, you're not gonna do it? Shoot him! Hey, okay, usually, usually those guys shoot the zombies. Let's head on inside because we have a trader inside of here waiting for us. No way our trader spawned on the ground. Okay, cool. It glitched. This is the trader up here. Uh, as you can hear, they are shooting outside now. This is the only way in game that you can see the time of day is coming to the trader. Obviously, I can't afford anything from this guy. Uh, I actually have never seen these. This is actually like my first time playing it. I only know a little bit about this mod pack from watching it to see if I wanted to play it. Basically, uh, as you can see, it gives you a work a usable, basically workbench in here. Uh, and guys, it's kind of cowardice, but I'm going to set my spawn here. Because you don't get a better spawn than this. Let's be real. And right off the get-go, we've got an anvil. As you can see, this is probably the safest place to be for that exact reason. Right there, the boys in blue are going to be protecting us. Let's hit, right. This should be food, actually. Yeah. Blueberries. These guys are actually breaking in already. No, 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 no. You guys need to rotate some of your defenses. I want to keep this place safe. Let's get outside. Alright, we've attracted a lot of attention already, but that is fine. We just gotta dip, dig, ugh, dodge, and zip our way through this. Let's collect some plant fibers. Uh, zombies are very powerful in this. As you can see, they've got a lot more health than normal. Uh, we need to... We need to put this on. Ah! Get away. Back it up, back it up. I will kill you with a hammer. There is a bear back there, guys. Oh my god. As you can see, this game has no mercy for new players. On day one, it will spawn bears and everything under the moon on you. Uh, you can crawl through one whole gaps. That is about the only thing that this game allows you to do right from the get go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. we have found ourselves a pretty decent weapon. For the very start of the game, guys, and this is gonna help us tremendously. Wow, you almost shot me, my man! Calm down, you little psycho. I can handle one or two zombies. If you guys can just handle that bear. Hey, yeah, uh, yeah, I heard you trying to sneak up on me, that cowboy. That bear is gonna be a real. Real problem if they don't deal with that, guys. That is right next to the the base, and that is not what you want to see. I'm loving this axe right off the get-go, though. It's kind of coming in handy, you know? It's kind of being a lifesaver right now. I wonder how strong... Ooh! That was almost a 50 hit. Get some potatoes out. Give me some coffee. Coffee in this game is... Amazing guys like there's nothing better than coffee and we get ourselves a wrench right off the get-go guys Jeez. 
Mostly used to make bread. I'll take it, sure. We gotta loot absolutely everything we can. Uh, I'm not gonna start scrapping stuff yet. I wanna start getting a bases down. Uh, we'll take that, we'll take the cloth fragment. Put on that clothing. Let's head on back outside. We do have challenges to do. As you can see, there is a wolf and a bear, and the wolf is walking right towards me. We're just gonna pop out over the back here while we look at our, our quests for a second. Uh, oh, can't accept the quest. So we need to have a sharp rock and make a stone axe. So to have a sharp rock, basically. Oh my god, those guys have no mercy. I want the the stone this time, not the iron. There we go. Gives us the iron basics. We can now make. Uh, if you come here and we go recipes, and we go where is it? Sharp rock. Let's make 10 of those for the heck of it. And now we can make ourselves a stone axe, guys. Yeah, somebody walking around me. That's fine. There we go. And we do get a reward for it. We get some clothing. And it does give us a little bit of extra storage. Uh, gather gas cans and gather iron. That is the next task. And as you can see, I've got this. So we just got to rock up to a car. Gather some iron from it and gather some gas from it. I don't know why they call it gas cans. Yes, because it does remove it into a can. As you can see, the gas is not a problem. We have already done the 50 gas. We've actually got an engine, which is one of the challenges later on, which is super handy. Doesn't get much better than that, guys. We just got to find another car. Whoa, we got a snowy biome mixed with a regular biome. That's pretty cool. Okay. There's so many zombies, guys. I have the zombie spawn rate set to 125 zombies allowed. So, at any point in this game, 125 zombies can be alive in the same area as me. So, there you go. At one point in the night, maybe on Horde night, I might have 125 zombies coming at my door. Not ideal for a uh, incredibly hard mod pack, but it is what we've got and what we are going to have to live with, guys. Let's take part of this car right here. Hopefully get the remainder of that iron. I'm looking for 11 more iron, my friend. Doesn't look like we're going to get it. I have to find another car. Or at least something we can get iron out of. I can't really go into the snowy biome yet. Aha, bumblebee. Hornet, sorry, not a bee. People get mad at me. Gather mechanical and electrical parts. That is what we have to work on now. We've got ourselves an iron shovel. The loot in this game is insane right now. Uh, let's check the upstairs. Yeah, I knew this was going to happen. I, uh, I could probably do repairing this first. Yeah, fucker. Yeah, fucker. Get away. Oh, God. Oh, God. Not good, not good. Just dodge and weave. Dodge and weave. Jump. Yeah! Parkour. We've got to wait till our fire axe gets repaired. Come on, game. Why is it going to take so Yeah, now you're in for it, boys. In for it, I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. We're going to chop you guys up one by one. Oh, yeah. Back it up. Back it up. As you can see, the uh, health bar at the top, it's just to help you because some of the... Uh, the demons and zombies that I've heard about in this game can have up to 10,000 health. So it is nice to know uh, how screwed you are before you get into the fight with said animal, creature, enemy, all of the above. As you can hear, there's quite a lot of zombies already gathering around this building because I've made a tiny bit of noise. Scrap gloves. This could be good. Okay, we do... What was that? Oh, it's armor. Okay, put that on, please. Okay, we can actually... Oh, give us another level 11 wrench, which is nice. We've got some good food already. That comes in handy. Let's let's just loot this place real quick. I don't really want to go down there. Cloth fragments I'm going to start collecting, because that is another mission I saw. That is a, a later on mission, but still. We need to gather mechanical parts. You're trying to come up to my, come upstairs to see me, hey? Oh, nice see you. Uh, I didn't ever introduce myself. I'm Rusty. Like this axe. Uh, you should probably update your tonight's shot. We got some drop loot from that guy. 
Eric's schematic? What does this do? Recipes. Advanced cooling mess insulated liner. Advanced magazine extender. Okay, that's pretty cool. So you can get some pretty deep stuff. Deep? Dope? Uh, we do have to rip apart all the electricals and mechanicals from cars and stuff like that because well, we need to complete our challenges as the challenges in this game do give you pretty decent rewards. But we will continue on scrapping this. Uh, scrap this. It does give me mechanical parts. It's not going to give me anything. Okay. Let's head on out. This is going to give us the electricals that we need. Let's take this apart. This is going to have loads of electricals in it. It's realistic, guys. Electrical stuff has electrical. Mechanical stuff has mechanical. Obviously, cars don't have much mechanical because they're kind of scrapped and uh, not much left in them. This car untouched. Come on. If I can just unlock it and move away. Oh yeah, we're getting into a big fight here guys, but we could use the XP. I'm not gonna say no to it. As you can see, there is loads of zombies around. I got zombies outside the gate, inside the gate, coming around the gate. It's gonna be a hectic mod pack guys, that's all I'm gonna say. Some 9 mil ammo, I'll take it, that's not actually too bad. It's damage, tear apart this damaged car. Hopefully get some mechanical parts out of it. There you go, it's turned into a regular car. We're getting the mechanical parts. Now we just need the electricals. Um, let's go to people's houses and tear apart anything electrical. Like these lampposts that somehow are lit up. These actually do give you electrical. So we'll tear these down. Hopefully get the 20 electrical out of that. One more, one more. That's fine, we got another lamppost over here. Fortunately, not a lot of stamina. There we go, we've done that. We need to gather wood, duct tape, and gather a blunderbuss. Okay, uh, wood, check. I don't really know how you want me to gather a blunderbuss. It's kind of more like luck. Um... But, okay. guess I'll try. Okay, I'm gonna keep dismantling cars along the way though, because everything you get from a car is pretty handy. Basically told me I need to loot POIs. So, uh, let's loot some dang POIs, okay? Coming in, scavenging has increased, as you can see, every single thing you do in this game basically can increase your points. We're about to get swarmed with zombies, I can feel it. I can feel it! Not good, at least this guy's a nice and easy kill. Unfortunately, it's not going to be like that this whole time. The athletics has increased, yes. Athletics is a good increasement. Ah, let's chop you up. I am sorry, decaying mother. But what I have and what you need. Oh, what I need and what you have are very different things. Uh, come on. Where's your secret loot room? Everyone has one. All your doors seem to be locked. I am going to loot your bookcases. There's usually some pretty handy stuff in these bookcases. Read both of those. Are you busting down this door for me? Thank you very much. I will hand, give you a hand with that. And we're just going to regenerate Stam and just come at you with full force. This fire axe is a legend. Very safe, boys. Okay, are we clear clearing this room for a second? No holes in the roof. We got some skill points I'm going to use quickly, real quickly. Uh, health nut, increasing my wellness, also increases my health and stamina. Uh, I want to put one into pack mule for more storage, two into pack mule for more storage space. Uh, 
Increase stamina regeneration by 5%, yes. Because we are using a hell of a lot of stamina, guys. We'll take the springs from this and the piping. Okay, are we busting through any more of these doors? What's this? The bathroom. Maybe we'll find a gun in the bathroom. Knock knock, anybody home? No. Nothing in the toilet this time. House front door. This doesn't look like a front door, it looks like a bedroom door. Coming in. Are you in here? No, okay. Usually they dive out the closet at me, so now I have to check the closet every time. The closed door behind me. As you can hear, there is lots and lots of zombies outside, guys. Oh. We should probably... Yeah, they're starting to find their way in. That is not good, guys. As you can hear, there is more glass breaking here. Looks like it is my time to go. I am going to have to dip out of here. Oh, you guys are busting in the front door. Come on in. Want to have a party? Let's have a party. Got to make sure no zombies sneak up behind me. You want some? I'm coming for all of ya. You're in my house now. Oh, not really, but the house I overran. Gonna loot all the clothing just because it's really good for scrap. Uh, I'm gonna take off. Oh, I guess because I can't take off, but scrap all that clothing. Oh, I see medical supplies in there. Gotta go for that. No one's in the toilet, thank god. Let's loot these medical supplies, that is actually a really good find. So is those cooking pots. Uh, where do those meds go? Let's bring them down to the hot bar. As I can feel like it's about to get pretty intense. Scavenging is now increased again. Happy days. Let's leave. Everybody is now in that POI. I need to find a POI that is going to give me a blunderbuss. This is intense, there is hundreds of zombies roaming around out here we're just gonna mosey on our way uh, maybe give this a little repair as we're running as it's getting pretty low let's keep on a running here guys there's a trader i know there's a trader here okay what's the other challenge because i know this one's pretty easy gather wood craft a wooden club okay let's Let's do that one quickly. Let's, uh, I believe this one's easier to perform and takes a little bit less luck. Let's craft ourselves a wooden. We. It, it wants us to make padded boots. We need to gather plant fibers. They so gotta make a full padded set. Which takes a lot of cloth fragments. We should have quite a bit. 40. Don't know if that's going to be enough to cover it. But we'll try. Uh, padded. Padded boots. Craft padded chest. Craft padded. Padded. Oh, just not enough to do the leg armor. That is fine. That is fine. We can easily make some plant fiber. Get some plant fiber. And make some more cloth fragments out of those. Just takes a wee bit of time. Uh, then we can make cloth fragments. Oh, wait, we need the cotton plants, don't we? And now we can still make the padded. Uh, what was the last thing we needed? Don't, don't correct me like that. Padded legs. There we go. That challenge should be completed, other than we need 50 plant fibers in our inventory. Okay. Let's start gathering plant fiber. As you can see, inventory management isn't going to be the greatest for the start of this. Hopefully, the day isn't coming to an end anytime soon, because we would be utterly screwed. Is that challenge done yet? Uh, padded leg armor. Did I not make the padded legs? Oh, they're still being crafted. Let's just do that. 
and then we can make the cloth fragments after out of the cotton. I would love to kill this cow eventually and get the animal fat because that is for one of the challenges. Alright, what is the next part of this challenge? Kill any zombie using a wooden club. Where is our wooden club? Okay, what we're going to do is start the zombie off with a big axe swing and I killed him in one shot. That has uh, almost never happened. Okay, we'll give you a light hit, a couple light hits, and we'll finish you off with a club. There we go. That is one kill under the books. Stop hitting me. Two zombies right here. I should probably gather up some stamina while backing up. That is free. Got a big boy. I believe this should be the last zombie for that challenge. It is. What did we receive? We received the pistol, and now I know the next challenge is to get a kill with this pistol. Or at least a couple kills. Do we have no 9 mil? Oh, it gives us 9 mil. That's good. Five kills with the pistol is the next challenge. And then it's, I think, gives us knuckles that we have to make. Ooh. actually against the zombie wolf in that one the pika is a bit easier to kill <laughs> good night sunshine I'm gonna gather all this cotton while well, we can hey businessman oh no don't come that close. The gun's not loaded. Now you can come that close. How many more kills do we need with this bad boy? Two more kills. Let's find two more zombies and put them out of their misery. Right here, right now. Gotta pick up all the cotton. As, uh... Let's go for plant fibers, you know? Might as well when we can. While it's safe and not dark out. For some reason, no zombies are here. Did I kill everyone? Did I kill all 125 zombies? I don't think so. No one's on those. Probably all in houses, but still. I'll bust through your house if I have to. Don't make me. Oh, it's unlocked. You're lucky. I'll bust into your house. Hey, bud. Sorry to do this to you. Ooh. Cloth fragments. Thank you. Kill more zombies. And this time... Knuckle wraps. Okay, we need to craft the knuckle wraps. Craft those bad boys. They'll be done in four seconds here. We need those. <gasps> I just heard a bear. We are out. Na 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 na. We do not have the ammo to be fighting a bear. We're gonna back up this way. This must be where the bear wandered to. Uh, not happy. Not good. Did not seem like a happy camper. So we'll just rotate this way. Oh no, you, look, now look, you smarted up, you put some guys on this side of the base where they've breached already. <laughs> oh well, we can eventually turn that into a mega horde base, guys. Just gonna scooch everything down, give you the old... Get you down to one shot and just oink. 
I think this is the best method to uh, quickly complete in the knuckle challenge because these knuckle gloves don't really do enough damage. Ooh, dropped the loot. I love when they drop the loot, even though. No! No! Hornet! Go away! Don't want to deal with you! I don't think I have anything that's gonna chop you up well enough to get honey out of you. No, I'm just gonna get rotten meat. Yeah, you're lucky. You're lucky I don't have a hunting knife. You would be my dinner. A big boy? Oh, yeah, that's a big boy. I'm a big boy. Try and get these challenges done for the first night, you know? Oh yeah, drop me all of the loot, please. Holy, those are some high level knuckles. I just need to gather duct tape and a blunderbuss. But I don't think I'm finding a blunderbuss anytime soon. There we go. That challenge is now done. We can... I'll just drop them. Screw it. And that is that for that. We just need to finish off the mechanics challenge. Which is going to be pretty uh, pretty hard. Because we have to find a blunderbuss. But now we can just go loot POIs. And, uh, you know. Hopefully find a blunderbuss. We'll start with this POI. Why not? Have I got wood on me? I do. Let's. Craft some wood frame blocks. I don't know if eight's going to be enough. Kind of a little cheat. To, uh. Usually the good loot stored on top. And if you're not an idiot, you can get to it. See? Cheat the system, guys. Don't play by the game's rules. That's what it wants you to do. I can hear you, but... <laughs> I love that they continue to walk towards you and you point the gun into their mouth. I'm not going to pick up any of that stuff yet. As you can see, they, this is trying to point us down. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, the weapon broke. No! Ah! Back it up, boy. Back it up, big guy. It's not your time, nor is it mine. Sorry, buddy. Can't let you get the first kill on me. Have I got enough to repair this? I do. We gotta keep an eye, a good eye on that repair status, guys. That keeps almost killing us. I don't know if there's any point in me taking flower. Uh, helmet? I will... Where? Gives me some armor. Gives me some protection. That's good. Some water. We're probably going to need that soon. That gives me radiation, right? Food poisoning, 10%. Not very good. Hey, buddy. Oh, yeah. I see your guns. Oh, ho, ho, you guys are all trying to protect it. So cute. But I got a gun! <laughs> Just gotta keep on backing it up. Thank you for the dropped loot. It is much appreciated, even though you gave me moldy bread. I will take it. I am coming to steal all of this loot. Reinforced chest, come on! Rad remover mod and padded boots. Uh, not ideal. Not ideal. Can of cat food. Still gives me radiation. Don't really want to eat that stuff until I get some rad pills. Oh, hey there. Yeah, you're just a farmer. You're easy. Literally. Pop your head like a cherry, mate. Alright. I guess we're fighting. Ah, 
don't trap myself. Like an idiot. Come on, buddy. Just die. It's a one-on-one. -on -one. We both... Oh, I have four skill points. Okay, have we got a second? Yes, we do. Let's quickly have a look at what we want to do. Parkour? Why not? We'll put one into parkour. Uh... Pack Mule, we could use another point into Pack Mule, why not? Better bartering, because we do live that. You don't need to eat or drink as much that. Chicken! Oh, ho, ho, dinner! Probably gonna get like one meat out of you here. This took us back upstairs, what? Where's the loot? Must be down. Oh. Lag spikes whenever it loads something, you know? Garment bag, anything good? Not worth, not worth. Scrap it! I'm gonna bust through this door. We need to see what is through here. I haven't found the good loot yet, I don't think. Haha, <laughs> I knew you were gonna do it! Oh, you're running. Oh no, is it night time? Oh, it's night time. We are so rude, guys. Are you doing other oh, we're so screwed. Oh no! No, 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 no! Fuck, oh, back oh, it oh, up, oh, boys! No! No! Oh, we're screwed. Guys, this is not good. This is not where I wanted to be. Not right now. We might just have to try and make a break for it. Ah, I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run. We're encumbered. We are not fast at all. But we have no choice here, guys. Just run and pray we can make it back to this safe zone. I think we're gonna make it though, guys. Not with this little stamina. We are definitely gonna have to take a break. Oh no. I see rad zombies. Back it up. It is not my time. Boys in blue! <laughs> Think it's time you saved me! Oh my god, I just found the Back it up! Yes! Shoot, boys! Shoot! <laughs> there we go, you can hear the bullets firing. Holy, that was uh. They still might make it in. Boys, they're making it in. No, 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 no. This is the last stand. Back it up. We got no choice but to try and stand here and fight them. Are you gonna use any more of those? But I only have three more. That's it, they're in! This is it, this is do or die here. Now I have six. Yeah, no. This item needs repairing right now! No, you made it in! No. Shovel! Don't do me bad, no, shovel! No, 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 no. Oh no. Repair. Repair! How long? We gotta wait eight seconds. They're trying to bust in through something. I see a rad. Oh, I see a rad through the door, boys. You want in? Come on. I'll give you a fight you want, boy. Oh no, they broke the bottom one! This is not a fight that they wanted. That I wanted. That anybody wanted. I'm still gonna kill you. I don't care if you're a rad. All right, have we, have we chilled? <laughs> that was no good, guys. Day one, and we have eradicated zombies. I can't let this guy die either, because we kind of need him. He does have vitamins for us. That could be pretty good. Does none of us have selling price? Oh, that, that sells for that much. 
Can I not sell to you at night time? Okay. Whew. That was intense. And we're definitely gonna have to fortify this place. Got here just in time. What have you got in your inventory? Lich. Oh, you got iron picks. Added armor. Okay, this is pretty good. Well, guys, that is night one, and that is where we're going to end the first episode. As you see, this base took a little bit of a beating. We're going to have to beef this place up if we're going to want to stay here. Uh, we probably aren't going to stay here permanently, but for now at least, this is probably the safest place we can be. That is where we are going to log off and have a wonderful and safe day. <laughs> See you guys in the next one.